wearing camouflage. This is Rick Mercer. You're watching by word of mouth at the Gemini's. Gemini. It's for Best Comedy Series. This is our ninth year on the air and uh, we're thrilled because we're just thrilled. It's one of those awards that is for everyone who works on the show. We got great writers, we've got the best road crew going, we've got a great director. It's just, there's an, it's an incredible group effort and, uh, and I'm thrilled. You never expect these things. I feel great. I'm really excited. Um, it's the, the best role I've ever gotten to play. Megan Fitzpatrick is, uh, you know, balls out, just absolutely uh, narcissistic, you know, total um, alcoholic, uh, hilarious, needy, crazy woman. And, uh, but very real and very grounded. I think that, I mean, I could just relate to her a lot. Like if, like, I didn't get, if I didn't get like the therapy that I needed through the years, like maybe I would be her. And um, so it, it, it's a tremendous honor to get to do the best work I've ever done and then to be recognized is mind blowing. Like my mind is blown right now. So it's hard to talk to people afterwards because you're like, ma, ma. that's what my mind's doing right now. <laughs> Uh, no, it's not. I mean, it's great to have a celebration of, of all, all the talent that's, uh, that's in Canada and elsewhere that comes back for this. Um, it's a, you know, and to, to work on a show as, as the lead of a show and then help put some of it together and, and work with really great people and bring some of those people together to, to put on a show. And it's a lot of work and hard fought. And, uh, you know, it's nice that some of the show got recognized, and, and part of it is through me. Uh, really good. You know, the more we celebrate Canadian content and culture, the better off we're going to be. Um, you know, there's such a plethora of fast food culture out there, which is, you know, an awful lot of stuff that's glitzy and addictive and fun to watch and cheap, but it's, you know, ultimately very unnourishing for our own society, which is very different than that sort of lowest common denominator stuff that we get imported. Um, so I think it's, it's hugely important that we celebrate our own. I know that sounds very trite and spoken many, many times before, but, uh, you know, build it and they will come. I, I truly believe that. Uh, really surprised, actually. Uh, I've been fortunate to win a couple before, but whenever Ron McLean is nominated, I think I lost to him about seven times, uh, and deservedly so. I always expect to lose. I think he's great at what he does, and so I was, I was really surprised. You know how people always say they don't prepare a speech or whatever? I, I legitimately did not. <laughs> Had a couple beverages before, so that was probably a mistake, but uh, uh, it, it's a real honor. The show that uh, we're nominated for, and I guess we won for, was the All-Star Fantasy Draft that we did last year, which was a, uh, a really strange show for me because it had never been done before where the captains were picking the all-star teams and we really were sort of making it up as we went along. We had uh, breakfast that morning and said, okay, how are we going to do this? And it was really fun to do from a TV standpoint because we were really just trying to figure it out how this would work. And uh, so it was a really challenging show, a bit of an awkward show, but it was really satisfying. So. I'm James Duffy of the Gemini's, this is by word of mouth. Peter Callahan, by word of mouth, the Gemini's. Callum Keith Rennie, by word of mouth, at the Gemini's. My name is Tracy Dawson, and by word of mouth, at the Gemini's, what? <laughs> <laughs>